Lee Kodiak Farm back here in yard number one we're just gonna check out the nuke that uh we moved into a two frame or the ten frame two weeks ago and see how they doing again now And pull this outside frame. I don't think we're going to have anything in here yet. You got a lot of propolis on it anyway. Yeah, they ain't really done nothing on that yet. Yeah, just two weeks ago, this colony was in a, a five frame nuke box and they were starting to get a little little tight in there so I decided to go ahead and move them into a 10 frame and I'm not seeing any eggs out here I didn't think the queen had made it that far yet Got a little bit of nectar in here. Nothing on this side. Look like they got some fairly new wax drawn out here. Maybe done some repairs. It's a lot whiter than some of the other piece of that same comb. But it looks like they got a pretty good population in here now. All right, we've got eggs and larvae in here. And quite a bit of it too. And here's our queen right here. We got eggs and larvae in this side also. Yeah. Got a couple of bees staring straight up at me, so my guard dog ready to attack. Got quite a bit of larva on this side. Well, they're getting ready to start capping some of that. Trying to look in the sun. See a little bit of nectar and pollen on this side. Looks like the cells are polished, but I've not seen any, seen any eggs in that frame yet. A little bit of nectar. Oh, well, you got some eggs and larvae in here. Larva's getting pretty big too. 
I should have put a pollen patty on these a week or two ago, maybe help them start brooding up a little bit faster. I'm not seeing a whole lot of capped in here. I am seeing pollen and eggs and plenty of larvae. But it just it's surprising I figured that it had some more capped by now. You know, we're starting to get a little bit of capped here. Not a whole lot, but got some pretty big larvae in there, so they should be capping that within the next day or so. Some larvae and eggs. Like she's just kind of skipping all around in the hive instead of laying out one whole area, capping it and moving on. It's kind of sporadic here and there. A little smoke in there. We have quite a bit of larvae on that frame and pollen. Well, hopefully maybe the next couple of days to start getting a lot more capped brood in here. I was hoping they'd have more capped by now, but it may have just took them a little time to get used to the new box. It's the only thing I can think of, but they got a whole ton of larvae in it, a bunch of eggs. I mean, population does look a little more than what it was when they had was in the fire frame. I know a lot of my videos that I show have mainly been in my number one yard right here at home. It's just as much as I've been working, not having too much time to go to the other yards and actually pull the camera out and do any recording. It's easier for me to just record here at home, but now that I'm back on a regular 410 shift schedule for work, I'm hoping I'll be able to get to the other yards more often and have actually more time while I'm at the yard to get my camera out and do a little more video work there. But they looking good. I just wish they'd have a little bit more uh, capped already. I didn't see any hive beetles in there, so that's a good sign. Maybe the peppermint that I put down in the bottom of the hive is helping out. <laughs> 